Hello everyone, welcome to another video. In this video, I will show you how to list products on eBay from CJ Dropshipping. Now, first of all, what you will need to do is you will need to actually sign in and register for CJ Dropshipping. After you have that, you will need to go to My CJ, and from there you will be able to add your store. Now, this is basically how it will work. You open the CJ website, after you logged in, obviously, you go to my CJ as I showed you right here to my CJ, and then you need to go to authorization and then eBay. Now, before you connect your store, ensure the store name is used to register on the CJ site. Then you need to click add store. After you add store, you will be need you will be needing to input your store's name, right? Then you will need to log into your eBay. After clicking the authorize button, you'll be directed to your eBay page. Enter email and password to log in into your eBay store and click I agree to authorize. Now, after you authorized your eBay, um, you know, with CJ Dropshipping, you will need to go and you will need to list products on eBay. Now, how you can do that, you, you need to find a product that you want and click list on the product page. This is how it will look like right here, as you can see. Click list then you will need to tick all the variants and complete the options. This is how it will look like right here. As you can see on this screenshot, you need to select the listing site. You, this can be found on eBay seller hub and overview, as you can see, of your eBay store. The currency type of the product price will be updated according to the listing site selected, as you can see. Then you need to make sure that total quality or quantity, sorry, of the product uh, listed does not exceed the listing limit on eBay as products will be removed once the inventory runs out. Now you can get more information right here on eBay quota. You obviously need to fill in the UPCEAN code if required. Um, now, as you can see, the UPCEAN code is dynamically generated by eBay upon product category. Uh, as, you, as you can see, you can click the yellow icon beside the UPC box, right? Uh, and you can see that right here on this, um, you know, picture right here. Um, or you can contact eBay support to get the code. So it's more complicated to connect and add products to eBay with CJ Dropshipping than with Shopify uh, because they don't have really good integration. Now you can also fill in does not apply if you cannot get the code as well. Um, tempor this is just a temporary solution and you need to choose a shipping method and fill in the rest of required information. So you just need to fill in the required information and keep continuing with the process. You can also edit the postage policy on eBay as well. Now, after that, you need to click list it now before you can find it in your eBay store. Note, if you only want to list part of the variants, you can click edit before listing the button beside the list it now, and then you will be able uh, to direct it to your following page. And again, remember to make sure that you have filled in all required information before you click list it now to submit. Now, as you can see, a reminder, due to various limitations set by eBay, you're likely to encounter some listing problems. So again, as I said, it's really, really difficult to connect with eBay and with CJ Dropshipping. But as you can see, to this connection, we've sorted the problems out and put the corresponding solutions in this tutorial. So you can visit this website right here, which is uh, basically how to list products on eBay, CJ Dropshipping, type that into Google and you will see this website and then you will be able to also visit their tutorial right here if you have any listing products problems. This happens a lot with eBay and CJ Dropshipping just because eBay has a lot of limitations already set uh, on their platform. So yeah, guys, thank you guys for watching. I hope this video is useful to you and yeah, we'll see you in the next video and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.